Welcome. In this video, we will learn to create a beautiful letterhead using LaTeX. A letterhead is actually is the heading at the top of a sheet, which consists of a name and an address and a logo. Okay. We will create such type of letterhead. So let's start. Here I have one folder which contains uh, three files: text file, one logo, and uh, one signature. I'll open this text file. This is a simple document. Document class is article. There are two packages: geometry for the margin and uh, times for the font. This letterhead we can create using a tabular environment with three columns: first column, second column, and uh, third column. Begin tabular and uh, end tabular with three columns: L, L, and uh, R. L for left alignment and R for right alignment. Here there are five rows: first, second, third, fourth, and fifth. For image, we can use multi-row, and we can merge all five rows of first column. Backslash multi-row. Number of rows is five. For the natural width, we can use a star symbol in this bracket. And in the third curly bracket, we can add the image. Just drag and drop. After that, we can write the rest of the content. We also need to add a graphics package for adding uh, images. Okay. For this horizontal line, we can use a rule command. At the place of width, we can use a text width command. And thickness, we can take 2.5 point. We can set the line spacing with the help of set space package. I want to use one half spacing, so just write here one half spacing in the square bracket and compile the file. We can put this table in the center of the page using center environment, begin center and end center. For changing the color, we need to use a X color package. Looking fine. Now we'll create these symbols using Marvo Sim package. Using this package, we can use a mobile phone, telephone, fax, and email commands. All right. In the next, we'll print a date. So at this place, we will use a today command. For keeping date at the right side, we can use as fill command before a today command. Date format we can change using a date time package. Here in the square bracket, just use a dd mm and four times y date, month, and year. At this place, we can write the main content of the letter. For closing part of the letter, we can again use a tabular environment. We can also use a vfill command for printing the closing part at the bottom of the page.
just drag and drop the signature we can remove the page number using uh, page style empty in the last we'll print the college name in this way so for this we'll use a text pause package now just use text block environment with one curly bracket and one round bracket at this place we can write the text okay here in the curly bracket we need to set the text box width and in this round bracket we can set the x and y positions of the text box let's check with minus one and minus one for rotating the text we can use a rotate box command we'll remove this angle is 90 and put the text inside this curly bracket we can also change the text font and color For shifting the text box at the right down, we can increase the X and Y positions. And for shifting at the left and uh, top, we can uh, decrease the X and Y. So this is the simple trick which you can use to create a beautiful uh, letterhead. That's all. Thanks for watching.